Hey students, I'm here with a quick video to help you understand some comments that I've given quite a few students in the draft of their research papers, which is using examples to illustrate any theories or quotes that you're giving within your body paragraph. So you remember that as you go through a body paragraph, you want to be thinking about your topic sentence, a quick follow up, then you get to your three eyes, and then after your three eyes, you need to connect that to something else. Oftentimes that something else would either be another source within the same paragraph or it would be an example to illustrate or to kind of hit the nail on the head to drive the point home for the reader. An example of this would be maybe I find a, I'm writing a paper about um, the Marvel Cinematic Universe. And um, I find some type of quote that suggests that Marvel is much darker than the DC Cinematic Universe. That could seem to stand on its own as an idea, but the idea doesn't have any backing at this point, meaning an example. We just have the ethics, right, or the, uh, the, uh, the credibility of the author who said it, which is fine, but you need to make sure that you're coming through your paper and making it clear how that's true. So for instance, I would give an example that it is in fact darker than the DC universe, and we could use Thor as an example of how dark the cinematic universe can get where we have a superhero who has lost his home, who's lost his mom, who's lost his father, who's lost his brother, who's seen his brother die right in front of him, who had to sacrifice his own home. All of those things are really heavy attributes to have to carry as a character. Um, so those would be the type of example that I would give to substantiate the claim that uh, Marvel is darker than DC. So remember, takeaway from this is if you give some type of theory or quote or idea, you need to back it up with some type of example. If you come up with that example on your own, that's fine. If you find an example within another text and connect it that way, that's also fine. All right, so I hope that helps. Uh, let me know if you have any questions and I'll try to get back to you as soon as possible. Thanks, guys.